Right, check out this 600 year old thatch cottage. We're here because it needs a big restoration. But before I get started, I'm going to show you the before and this is the back slope of the house with a field full of mushrooms. I couldn't resist but give it a little flip. Also down the other end of the house, the gable is in need of a big repair. So that's all got to be stripped and new stuff put on. Back to the pull and fill. I'm going to start pulling out all of the old reed. Then I'm going to get my shears and cut some new reed to a suitable length to insert it into the coat work. Here we go, little demonstration. Opening up the old coat work, inserting the new and getting it roughly into place with your hand. Next, grab the leg it, go over the top of it, good old smacking away. Doing pull and fill on a thatch cottage is a good option because it gives you at least another decade before you've got to renew it. 